my winning Today I'm doing a what is in my makeup bag. I've never done one of these before. Um, and this is also a collab with my friend Amber. I'll leave her channel and her half of the video to this in the description along with all her social media links. I always talk to her on Twitter and her videos are amazing. I love her videos so much and she's so nice. So please, 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 please go watch her videos and subscribe while you're there because I'm telling you now you will not be disappointed. Whew. Now that I've got that out the way, let's start with the video. <laughs> so this is my makeup bag, it's from Victoria's Secret and I got this not so long ago, I actually got it for Christmas um, and it's really pretty, it's just got sequins on it and it's all glittery and I like it a lot. The first product is a primer and this is the Body Shop All-in-One Insta Blur. I love this so much because it stops your face from getting greasy throughout the day but it like literally is like a glue for your foundation, it makes it stick, it ain't gonna budge if you use this, I'm telling you now. So next is an eye primer, and I don't actually use eye primers that much, but this is in there anyway in case I do want to use it. This is the MUA Pro Base Eye Primer. It's not the best primer I've ever used, but it does the job, um, so that's in there. Moving on to foundation. This is my all-time favourite foundation, and whenever I don't really know what foundation to use, I always, always, always just go back to this, because this is like my holy grail foundation, literally. How dirty the lid is, it's slightly embarrassing. Um, this is in the shade 51 Light Vanilla. So well used, most of the writing has rubbed off it now. Um, but yeah, I still love it so much, and I've already got a backup because I can tell this is going to run out soon. And the same with this one, all the writing has rubbed off this too. This is the Rimmel Wake Me Up Concealer. There is nothing left in this. I finished it off this morning. There is literally nothing in there. I was scraping it to try and get some, something out of it this morning. But no, I'm not getting any more uses out of this. Um, and then to settle that, I use the Rimmel Stain Matte Powder. This is even pointless me talking about this because I use this every single day. And I talk about this in a lot of my videos because I love it. Again, it's my Holy Grail powder. I love it a lot. I've just got this in. I've just got this in 01 transparent, and I'm not going to talk about this anymore because I spoke about it so much, and I'm sure pretty much all of you know about this already. I probably should have shown you this at the beginning, but for a lip balm, I've just got the Nivea Essentials Care. There's always different lip balms in my bag, and um, because I'm forever using them up, there's only a little bit left of this. Um, this is really nice. They're really thick and creamy. The Nivea lip butters and I like them a lot. The contour and highlights, I've been using the Sleek Face Contour Kit. I love this so much. Both of these shades are so nice. The contour is so easy to blend out so you don't have just a brown line on your face. And the highlight is so pretty and shimmery. So that's all for contour and highlight because I haven't been using any blusher at the minute. For brows, I recently got my brows tinted so I haven't been filling them in although the dye is starting to fade. Um, I've just been like kind of setting them in place with my MUA um, clear brow gel. Cheap, I just got the swim team drug, I can't remember how much it cost but it's not very much at all. Moving on to eyes, for eyeshadow I've been really liking using the Benefit Cream eyeshadows because they're so quick and easy to put on and they're so nice and creamy. The shade I've got in my makeup bag at the moment is Bikini Teeny. Literally just a champagne colour and it's so nice. And for eyeliner, I've been really liking using gel eyeliner. So I've got the Maybelline New York Gel Eyeliner. And I've got this in the colour 08 Black Gold. It's so pretty because at first it just looks black. But in it is like gold flecks. And it's so pretty. Like I can't get over how pretty this is. This is the Bourjois Volume Glamour Max Holidays Mascara. This is waterproof and I've got this in the colour 52 Ultra Black. It separates your lashes so much and gives them so much volume and makes them so thick and nice. And it's a really, really good mascara. I recently discovered this by Simple. This is the Simple Kind to Eyes Eye Makeup Correct Pen. It's this little pen and it's like... Um, makeup remover in it. This is so good because you can like just take off the little bit that you want and I've used it quite a lot because I always smudge my mascara. And the last product is a lipstick. This is the MAC lipstick in cream cut. This is a cream sheen lipstick. I'm wearing it today. I love it so much. Um, 
and yeah basically so for foundation i use the Eva silk finish brush and this is so nice and it blends foundation like a dream i love it so much and um, i'm actually writing a blog post on all of these Eva Zoe brushes so i'll link that blog post in the description the um duo fiber face brush for powder this is so nice because it applies powder so lightly and it doesn't make it look cakey or anything like that contour i use the zoeva um face shape brush this blends the contour so nicely and it's the right size just to kind of fit it in the hollows of your cheeks so that's really good the concealer i use the zoeva and um, concealer buffer this is really good to get like underneath your eyes and like around your nose um, and just places like that because it's nice and small and finally for eyeliner i've been using the zoeva wing liner brush this is so thin which is why i love it because it applies the eyeliner so nicely so that is everything in my makeup bag it is now empty the products i've been really liking using at the moment please go check out this video out and subscribe to her and if you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up and um, don't forget to subscribe while you're there if you want to see my videos in your subscription box and yes, that is it. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Goodbye! I wish that you were